Hey guys, so it's the day two of no writing week. Let's just call it writing week. Um, Lindsay is currently taking a nap. It is actually two o'clock in the evening. I'm so sorry. I wish I brought you guys um, with me because like we went to pick up my new glasses. It's my new glasses because I have double vision and we need to get new glasses for my double vision because my other glasses, which are around here somewhere, I think, I don't know where I put them, where are they? Anyways, those are for reading. These are to fix my double vision. So I have to get new glasses and I like them a lot. Um, and then after that, we went to Barnes and Noble, looked around, Lindsay signed some of her books that were in the store, and then we just came back, had breakfast, uh, not breakfast, lunch. And lunch was some salad and potatoes, they're so good. Um, yeah, and now I'm just doing some work while Lindsay naps. I need to upload a video, I need to put some links in the video for the books, and then I need to sign some contracts, and yeah. And then we're going to start writing Zenith. We have a lot to do today, since we are on part three, which is really part three and four, but we just... It was combined to part three, so it's really two parts, but in one. It's weird. So yeah, we're gonna work on that. I'm tired right now. Maybe I should take a nap. Do a thousand words a day without missing a single day. We'll, um, you won't make it. By the deadline? Yeah. <laughs> da da da. Crap. Lindsay's giving me bad news. Awesome. So Lindsay's saying if we write a thousand words a day, we won't make it by our deadline. Yeah, but a thousand words is like child's play. Yeah, you write a thousand <laughs> words anyways. Like, we got it, and, and there's two of us, so let's just put it out. Let's, like, say uh, 2,000 a day. Literally, we'll like, still... we're putting this math in the hands of two people that don't know don't how to math. Don't know how to We can't math. We can't math. Okay. Not like we don't want to. Um, we actually just don't want to. So, days until the deadline, I actually have it. Oh, no, I have something on my phone. Oh, my phone just died. I need to go this is the actual deadline that we have. This is what a writer's desk looks like right now. 30 days. Exactly. 30, exactly 30. Mm -hmm. And we need 40,000 to even hit 80. So, wow. what that means, let's see. Well, how long, we started writing about two weeks ago on the 20... That's it? Are you 27th, serious? we started. That's seven. We like signed our like almost twenty days ago. Our death warrant. <laughs> like the thing is, Lindsay and I are aiming for this book. Like this is going to be the very rough, rough draft, but we still want it to be good. We don't want it to hand in a piece of crap. So it's really divided by. We're we're, in, we're, we're stressing out a lot. Divided by three thousand. That's ten. Crap. What math are you doing? I don't know. <laughs> okay, guys, we'll get back to you in a little bit once we math. Well, once we can math, because right now we can't. Mm -hmm. All right, so we need mountains. Yeah. Um, cliffs, mountains, and red. I'm not writing on the ground. We also need to make up their religion, language, work. Okay, so we need to pick, I think, central location for governess. Yeah. What if, like, the, I don't know if this is possible, but if, like, the whole planet. No, that'd be too hard. I mean, they need to have a really valuable resource on this planet that they use to, like, trade with the other planets. And something that Zentera can't get. Yeah. And every planet needs to have something that's valuable to them that makes them valuable to the other planets in the system. Um, and that's where the party is, so it's close enough to them that they can, like, get there, but far enough away. How many subs do we have? Hey guys, so uh, Lindsay and I just had dinner. We had some spaghetti squash with some meat sauce. It was so good. Did I say spaghetti sauce? I meant 
spaghetti squash with meat sauce um and it was so good and now we're back to writing we just did a lot of planning um of zenith because even though we like sold our book to the publisher and everything and they liked what we had we still wanted to touch up on some details so we went into that that was like took like two hours that's what we did after we plotted out some of adhere's landscapes because we wanted to make these alien worlds a little bit more alien because it is not of our known universe right now so we have that liberty to create these worlds and make them as diverse and unique as possible so that was really fun um and yeah now we're just gonna be writing um and then tomorrow we have a phone call with our editor not our phone call. we don't have a phone call we have a skype call with our editor lauren and she is awesome lauren smolsky of harley quinteen and um we cannot wait to do that because we're gonna go over some of the detailed changes that we're doing it's really exciting so um yeah so we're just gonna go write some more and i wanted to make this vlog a little bit more of a writing type of vlog but we're gonna be doing actual writing vlog later but this is gonna mostly be highlighting like what we're working on this week so yeah guys i'll talk to you later i'm doing a lot of i'm so sorry my mouth is just so in love with what we just ate so okay bye Lindsay, do you feel ripped by jumping on there <gasps> look this is how authors work out a mini trampolines in their offices <laughs> yes now do a front flip Yes! Totally, totally saw that. Olympics. Still writing. Lindsay's writing over there, and the dogs are watching us write. Um, we are about to hit 100 pages on this document. We probably already hit 100 pages like way long ago if we had part one in this doc, but like this is a huge another accomplishment, so yay! And my dad brought us cappuccinos, so thank you, dad. We needed them. It is currently 8.39. I'll probably be writing for a little bit longer. Okay. Lindsay and I are trying to figure out who came up with Zenith. I feel like we were both searching it at the same time and I think, I don't know. Oh no, we were doing the same exact thing. We were looking at the same we exact page together. We were probably on Skype. Thesaurus. On Thesaurus. That's can never like pronounce that word. I, we love Thesaurus. Um, right now we're just like thinking about names for book two because you know. name book two Altoid? I know, we should name Altoid like no joke. I would love that. It's like on the shelf. We're gonna have Altoid, like something like Altoid in the book. Because like, if you guys do not know, that's what I wanted to name Valen, one of our characters, because we couldn't find like a like a hot guy's name um, for the longest time. So I'm like Altoid, <laughs> and it was like this ongoing like inside joke for the longest time. So Altoid, that'll be great. But um, yeah, we're just like thinking about some stuff. I literally just like googled words like Zenith, but nothing comes up, and we need something different than Zenith. So this is going so well. Not really. I'm gonna look more. Mm -hmm.